Can you hear me? I haven't tested it out yet. Um, let me just double check something. Well, hopefully you can hear me. If not, never mind. <laughs> Galactic Jam Chris is here. And as the title says, I am giving you, as you've read the description, my my opinion on what the best game you can possibly buy on the big J Japan sale. Um, this is for the PS4, that is. On the PS3, um, I would say pick up all the Tales games. Um, definitely, definitely. I mean, that's just madness with all the Tales games that you can get. But um, that's, we'll leave that for another time. This is my one of my favourite MMOs ever. Heaven's World Final Fantasy 14. Okay? This game is brilliant. And on the PS4, you can get it for $32.99. And you'll have the expansion and the main game. And for that, that is a steal. This game is highly recommended by Galactic Jam, myself, Chris. Um... It is one of the best MMOs, MMORPGs, I've ever played. If you do not know what an MMORPG is, well, I'm going to go to the most, the most, one that, that is the most, well, it's not the most popular anymore, but it's one that everyone knows about. Well, they should know about it, and that's World of Warcraft. Um, don't worry, if you hate World of Warcraft, don't, don't leave, don't leave, don't leave. Oh, go back to the cutscene. This is this is much, 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 much better than World of Warcraft. Um, I haters gonna hate. I I don't care. You know, um, if you hate Final Fantasy, it's probably the best you don't play this game. You won't enjoy it. If you have never played Final Fantasy, um, definitely give it a go. You um, you don't need to play any other Final Fantasy in, in this series. Um, you could play this game without playing 13, 10, 11, 12, you don't need to, you get 9, 8, 7, you pick up any of these Final Fantasies and you can jump in and most of them do not require you to, ha um, wow, yeah, majority of them don't require you to know fuck all about any of the other titles. Um, like, you can get into this game, and like, right from the straight off, you people won't know um, anything more about it by playing, say, 13. You could just start this game and enjoy it. People go, I played 13, and you go, yeah, that's cool, mate. I'm playing 14. And then, then, you know what I mean? You'll know your stuff, they'll know their stuff about 14. You'll know your stuff about 14. Um, this is different, though. There's two MMOs that Final Fantasy has done um, that I'm aware of. Um, I'm not going with the mobile uh, games because I, I don't know. I, I don't deal with those type of games. I'm, I'm, a, I'm a console gamer myself and a bit of a PC gamer. Well, you can get this on PC, you can get this on Steam, I, I wonder what the, how much this is on the summer sale, but this is on the big Japan sale on PlayStation, I think it's a steal. This is... I, I, when did I start this? I started this last year. I have only put about 100 hours into it. And that's not much, by the way. That really is not enough. When you're playing this game, you will lose hundreds and hundreds of hours. And you could just... You could put 500 hours into it and still find more to, to see and do, explore. It is... It is immense. It is immense. The thing is with these MMOs, people get really put off by them because they look at them and they go, "Right, I haven't got the time for that. I got a job. I've got, I've got a family. There's no way. What, what's the point of getting into this game where I know that I can only put an hour or two in, or not even that sometimes? Well, if you can put an hour and two, two in." What do you want to do? Do you want to put an hour and a two two in with something something that you can care about, or do you want to put an hour or two in in something you don't give a shit about? So that's the point. All right. You, I, I don't, I don't play this game religiously. I'm not even maxed out. Okay, I'm not on there like twelve hours a day, like or anything like that. I'm on it for about an hour or two. 
depending on what's going on, I've only just started, I've only downloaded it now, really. And, um, again, for, um, not playing it for a while. And I'm not maxed out, I think one of my classes, the highest it is, is level 40, you know, so, I'm very casual at games anyway, m most of them. But, that's still okay. You can still enjoy yourself. Single player, co-op, whatever. You will enjoy this game. Why? Because it's everything you can get from a good game these days. It's got it's got that sandbox exploration that you can go all over the place. You've got that quest sort of system where you can pick it up and you can do that. And you don't have to do anything else if you don't want to. Or you can do it all. So you can tailor to how you want to play. Um, there's, there's not really that much restrictions. I never feel like I was restricted to play a certain way. I felt like I could just do what I want. And the game, the game was beautiful. So, um, um, I gotta say, um, out of all the MMOs I've ever played, and I've played a fucking ton, right? <laughs> this is probably one of the best ones I've played ooh, in the last five years. I'm not gonna go any higher than that. But, um, so, let's see what it's all about then, shall we? Okay, I'm gonna go. No, so, you start here with this gate. Oh, oh shit. Um, I'm, no, 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 guys, on, uh, on, okay. On. Um, so this game is one to my heart, okay? So my in laws have just got in, so I just want to say hello to them, so I'll, I'll be right back. Sorry, I know I shouldn't do this. You're right, man. You're right, Chris. Alright, I forgot that we're going to watch Independence Day today. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay. So um, I want to cut this a little bit short because I don't want to be on this too long. But I'm going to just quickly go into the world. This is uh, one of my characters, and um, we're starting up now, and I'll show you what it looks like. But I would. I would highly recommend this to anyone that is sort of not not willing to um, not willing to spend out a load of money because it's cheap right now, you know. So it's on sale. I mean, I I got a feeling you'll get it cheaper on the PC because you got the summer sale. But the one I would get would be the twenty five pound one because that you get a month's free subscription and. The expansion, Heaven's World, I got it, but I'm not even at that stage yet. So you could save that for another time. So I, I think it's the £25.99. I don't know what it is in other countries, you know. But, but um, anyway, here it is. Okay. Right, yo. Okay, so, um, as you can see, it's a very gorgeous looking game. Um, like a lot of them, um, doesn't really matter too much of the graphics, it's dep it all matters about the gameplay really, but it is a good looking game. Um, mind you, I should have gone on to the customization of this game and show you that, I will do that at another point, I will do a video showing you the customization. Because um, I think that would be brilliant to see how much you can create your character. Me and my wife made a character. We, because we love cats, we both made a sort of a, a cat type of character. But, um, but like I said, um, this is one of those MMOs that is kind of different from a lot of them, where other MMOs restrict you 
from playing as uh, who you want to pl uh, play as. Like, say, if you wanted to play as a thief, you can go around thieving people, but then you would be restricted to play as that type of class. You know, this game has got a lovely thing where you just uh, change a weapon. I, you can set them on a gear set, so recommended gear, gear set. You can you can change to any of whatever you want to be. So I've got a minor there. I can go to a fair. I can just go to Paladin. Uh, what is put as PLD and I put equip set, changing my gear, and now I am a Paladin. So you can see that and I've got a whole new armor set. Um, got a weapon, and you see each of the the character. It's got different levels, you see? So, I'm a level 14 Paladin and a 27 Gladiator. Now, that may be a bit confusing for people, but how can I put it? Is, um, this is... This is, um, a gear set, uh, a soul crystal. When, when you get to a certain level as, uh, as... Let me show you, let me show you. Okay. When you get to uh, a gladiator, it doesn't show anything different. You look at the character sc screen, you'll see that's level 14, level 40. And then you go back on to um, Paladin. They're similar classes, it's level 40, 40 but I've only leveled up the, the, the Paladin to 14 because when you reach level 30 as uh, the gladiator, you start leveling up the paladin, but you're doing it with it. It's a bit confusing, I don't understand it myself, but it's, it won't let you sort of start again. So, like, with these soul crystals, they're like your advancement. So you start out as, or, uh, you can pick a class out of nine, What I will put up on another video, giving you an outlook at all the classes. And um, I'll delve into it a lot more then. But um, this is an advancement class, and it doesn't mean it's better. It just means it's uh, tailored to more of a specific role. So the paladin's more of a tank, whilst uh, a gladiator is a bit of DPS and tank. If you don't know what I mean by tanking or DPS, well, a tank's a defender, and a DPS is somebody that attacks. So, um, one's sort of catered for both, and then another is just focused on one. That's all. So, if you ever get into a group, like I get in a group with my wife, and she plays as uh, a bit of, uh, as a range, sort of checking magic at people, I end up uh, defending her as a tank. So, this helps me um, get the most of it, really, with her. But like I said, it's not, like, some classes are a bit hard to play on your own. Like, you, if you're playing on your own, really, I should switch to Gladiator. But because I'm a tank, I'm not worried about it. It's like, say if you're a healer, um, they've got two classes of healer. You've got, um, if I remember correctly, you've got the Conjurer. And if I'm, I may be wrong, there's a, I haven't even got this class. Um, um, and then you've got the class when you become a white mage. If you're there in a party as a white mage, you can cure everyone, but you can't take much damage, so then you want to be a conjurer, so you can have to do a little bit more damage. So it, it caters you to sort of to any sort of playstyle that you want to be. If you just want to roam around and explore and just beat the shit out of people, it's all good fun. But um. Things are easy as you can see because, like I said, I'm level 40 and what are these guys? Oh, let me have a look. A couple... Level... F level 3. So I'm not... It's not posing much of a challenge, on it? So it's not... It's not worth it. But, um... This is a nice thing now, though, because... I'm here killing all these things and it's a bit boring, but, uh... See when you get in the game. I could just go... Let's say if I wanted to play as... Oh, let me think, let me think. What have I got my four primary ones as? Say if I wanted to play as a miner, okay? So I put the set for a miner, 
And now I'm a miner, you see? So now I can, as you can see, I've got it in quite a, a funny costume. I do quite like it myself. I know you, uh, you people will be giggling, but I do like, I do like it. But that's a nice thing, because you can, when you, uh, when you change your different classes, you can set up different armors for them, and then you can quickly on the fly, chop. as you can see, now you can see those little lights, what does that mean? Well, it means I can go up, and if I pick one of these, so say if I wanted a bone tip, I could get, I could get that. So I'm mining for some bone chip. Alright. So you understand that uh, this is the best thing I love about this game. That everything, everything has its own class and level system. You notice that I was level 40 on that paladin. I'll show you now. Wait, wait a minute. Now this may be a thing to put you off, but I love it. Okay. Is the fact now I am a level 21 miner. So that means I have to completely level up this class and I have to completely level up that paladin. So that's like, okay, so altogether the amount of replayability and expanding on different sort of customization and characters. Every time I go to a new class I can make it look like what I want to make look like. Obviously you're going to have to put some time in it. Not at the beginning your character is going to look completely different every time you expand the class and every class you got you got to put time in it you know like I said I put a, a hundred or more, more hours of game and I'm not focused on ever really you won't ever complete a game you won't ever complete a game like this you've just got to set yourself targets and when when you've done that you know be happy to just stop playing you know if you're one of those type of uh, obsessive gamers that want to pl play their game to the point of not having a sleep then enjoy yourself and you'll do a lot better than me um this is really cool now you saw me uh getting getting some of this bone chip now what can i do with this okay so i may make a fool of myself right now because i may find out that i couldn't do anything with this bone chip as a goldsmith but i'm going to go as my goldsmith now as you can see i've got different type of lovely clothes for that character and I go on to that one and I go to the crafting log now let's have a look shall we right level one to five so you see that I've got two bone chips I, I've got the bone chips but have you looked I have I need animal animal snoo sinew okay like i can't make that so i have to go and get that from somewhere to be able to craft that item but if i if you uh let's have a look at see what i can craft that i've got i probably ain't got nothing i craft it on and sell it and then go out building let's have a look shall we i'll probably go around my level level 11 to 15. so there we go i can make a brass um, ing ingot. I can't pronounce fucking words to save my life. <laughs> anyway, um, so I can make I can make brass rings. Okay, cool. So I take that and I simplify that. So there we go. You see that, and I can make an item. What's well, pretty cool. So it rewards you. You go around exploring wherever you explore, and as a miner, you. Um, you you, you uh, grind and all of that on your on your rocky mountains and all of that, and then um, then you can make them into items as either as a goldsmith as a, all the other classes. I like I said, I'm going to get into this game and show you all the classes because I just put this on the day and I've forgotten most of them. But you like this one, you've got goldsmith miner and blah blah blah. Oh wait a minute. There you go. That was easy for me anyway. But I've, now you see I've sim simplified that. So I've made that. So we've got some brass rings. And off I go. But like I said, have you noticed that all those little 
things have disappeared, things that were glowing, that I can't mine. Well, because I'm a different class, I can't mine them, so I have to go back as a miner. So, um... There we go. Thank you. See you in a minute. It will show me on the mini-map. There is one over there. Yeah, one just here. That's up there. Okay, we're in it. Anyway, you can see that one shining over there. There you go, up there, and I can mine that. You get the picture. So, like I said, um, it's not very wise to battle with these classes. Like, I'm not really that worried because I'm, these are level three and I can do a bit of damage. But you're not meant to really. These are not combat classes. These are crafting and gathering classes. You see. But, uh, like I said, at this level, I can kill these quite easily. But, um, I'm going to make another video later on, just showing off some of the things uh, that you can do in the game. But I'm going to keep it quite short today. I just wanted to tell you, on the big Japan sale, it's uh, £25. And like I said, this is better than every MMO I've played. And the ones I've played is World of Warcraft, Star Wars Hero Republic, some of the free games like RuneScape and all of that, loads of them. Um, uh, even now the scrolls online, I don't mind now the scrolls online. A lot of them are good games, but this one is a really good pickup if you ever played a Final Fantasy and you enjoy it. I will do another video later. I feel like I need to get off now because I got to get ready to watch a film. But um, I hope you enjoyed the video. Please like and subscribe and. I'll speak to you soon. Thank you very much.